Hi everybody, I'm outside the Premier Inn here. This is where we're staying in Southampton and I'm going to give you a tour of our room. Welcome to another Journey with Josh. Okay, we are at room 116 at the Premier Inn, so let's go look at it. Okay, normally I would show you what was on the back of the door, but there really isn't a whole lot on the back of the door. Um, we're not on a cruise ship, so there's no muster station there. But let me show you the room. All right, as you come in, just to the left, there are some hooks to hang your coats, jackets, or whatever. Um, plenty of space below that for luggage. On the left-hand side here, there is a uh, wardrobe area. Um, this right here is like a vanity. So you can bring the chair over and people can put on makeup or whatever. Uh, I find the lights not that bright, but I guess it might be perfect for putting on makeup. And then you have a hanging area on the wardrobe. Below that storage to put backpacks or whatever. You've got a single drawer. And then we're using one area of the wardrobe to put a suitcase. Above that you have a kettle with some glasses and some tea which I'm already having and then you've got another shelf up there and if you need more space there is space above the top shelf there on the other side here there is a near full length mirror and then there is the bathroom bathroom is nothing special really but it is quite spacious You've got plenty of room on the counter there to put uh, your toiletries, fairly large sink, and then you've also got uh, a soap dispenser for your hand soap. All around you've got a very deep tub and then a soap dispenser for uh, hair and body gel. Fairly nice shower. Water stays warm and gets hot if you need really, really hot water. As I said before, the tub is a very deep tub and it is a steep step. The one thing, uh, thing that I would say about this bathtub is that it is quite dangerous because it is very, very slick once it gets water in it. And these little um, grip marks don't grip at all so be very very careful while you're in this tub otherwise you will fall and bust your head open on the back side here you have a towel rack there are no washcloths here they do don't give you washcloths unfortunately but that is the bathroom And then as you come on around, you have, I think that is a full-size bed, sleeps quite well, very comfortable. Your nightstands are nothing special, you have light switches, you have the light, there is no electronics hookup beside it to power your electronics, no phone adapters, no power adapters, no USB ports. Same thing for the other side. You do have a little power adapter, power outlet down there. On around, we have a fairly comfortable sofa. Nice window, let some light in. It is double paned, so there is very, very little noise there. And then on around, you have a desk area. As you can see, we're using it for electronics. You've got two power outlets there, and then you actually have a power outlet there if you wanted to unplug their light. And you do have some audio vid video hookups, I guess, for the television there. But as you can see, very spacious room. Easy to get around with and plenty of space for luggage if you're going on a very long cruise. 
and that is room 116 at the Premier Inn in Southampton, UK. Uh, it is close to the mall. It is close to uh, a lot of other restaurants and stuff like that. So it's very centrally located. It is close to the port, uh, the, the city port, I believe that's what it's called, um, where the Royal Caribbean cruises go out of, which is what we're on. I hope you enjoyed this tour. If you did, give it a thumbs up. That real, really helps me on YouTube. And also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And as always, thank you for tripping with me.